Welcome back to Docs Hot Shop and Forge. So a while back I started a wrapped eye axe project. Mostly just to show that perfectly clean steel isn't a requirement for successful forge welds. It helps, but welds will still take even if rusty. Now many months have passed and I finally figured it was time to use the axe blank that I'd made back then. But, for what? The shape and mass distribution weren't ideal, and if I tried a traditional hatchet it would just look odd. Why not make something more suited to the mass distribution then? But again, what? What axe has a plain rectangular blade? A bit of googling brought up mortising axes. These were used to build bridges and other large structures and oddly enough post and rail fences. So follow along as I make a small mortising axe. again and we'll work the edge this time. Delamination happening there. Keep that warm whilst we get flux. Alright, so it's just that little corner there. We might end up with far too much anyway, so it could prove surplus. We'll see. Alright, that's looking a lot better. Still not quite taking there. That's alright, we're going to end up with way more bit than we actually need. And it's just that little corner there.
So what we want is a slight taper. We don't want to work the edge too much because we might cause it to delaminate again. work on that distal taper. cut off the bit that repeatedly delaminates we're going to so we've got the, the square end with the tool steel we're going to forge upset this stuff back in on itself so by creating a dome leaving that hitting in the middle and then once we've got it there we can start to draw it out into a bit of a point which will get us ready with the fine grinding and all the rest of it once we fix the eye. So.
cold. Trying to keep those cheeks about equal. The size a bit thicker than it should be. That's going to take a fair bit of cleaning up, and it's still twisted. So after much umming and ahhing, I finally did it. The grinding of the blade to profile is done. Now for the important questions. How were these hafted? And how were they used? So this is what we've ended up with. This is a mortising axe. Um, the blade is long, parallel, and I'm assuming it was used to carve out the hollows. Uh, for a tendon to go into. So this one has a piece of tool steel that runs the entire length of the blade and mild steel on the outside. So I still need to grind to sharpness um, and make a handle for it. But um, yeah, it's done. So it'd be kind of fun to try and figure out how to use one. Um, We'll see if I find time to do that in the near future. I now have a Patreon, so if you'd like to provide financial support for the channel, that would be greatly appreciated. It helps me get new tooling, um, improve the shop for making recording easier, so I'm working on soundproofing at the moment, um, and any donation is just that, a donation. The content will always be free. The link to my Patreon is down below. As always, if you've enjoyed this video, hit the thumbs up. Feel free to share on social media, and if you haven't already subscribed, I would greatly appreciate it if you did consider subscribing. Don't forget, hit the notification bell when you do. So get out to your shop, have fun, but do stay safe, and I'll catch you for the next one.